Boy, I tell you, this should be a, a YouTube exclusive here. You know, John T. Wright, I am the Lord. I am telling you, things are warming up a little bit. They're getting awfully hot. I'll tell you, well, let me tell you, I've got the Hyden Biden machine, and you know what? When I turn this baby on, man, oh man. Did you hear the music there? Watch this. You don't think this thing moves? You, I control the lights. That's right. I can make them shut off. I can shut off Donald Trump's lights too. I can make them uh, go big. I can make them blink. I can make them stop. I can make them blink faster even. I can make them stop. Isn't that nice? Isn't that fun? And Jesus leads the San Patisus and I told you, you know, the other day about the swan and it comes in or the white whatever it was, it flew right in, it sat right there upon and it went straight down. Um, I told you about Madeline Jackson seeing her just last night and it feels pretty good, God damn it, I'll tell you that right now. And the next one was, was this Susan Jane Donahoe, she shows up. I went down to my mini storage unit and there is somebody, you know, walking back and forth between her park and, and her door, you know, and she's a few doors down from me and I see a young gentleman, I imagine it's her old man, you know, like that. And you know, pretty soon she walks past there and she gives me a look and I, you know, I just give her a little wave like that. You know, she waves back. And, uh, pretty soon, I, I was going to go down to the, uh, office and I was going to talk to them, you know, about some business I have there with them because I'm, you know, probably getting ready to move out there and I'm not going to leave them or anything. And I told them I'd even give them notice. And if I'm not out of there, if I'm not even close, I mean, I'm not going to rush it. I don't want pressures. I'll pay the next month even. I just don't want no goddamn hassle and I'm going to be selling it, what shit out of there there is. And I walked up there like I was going off and right there where that white truck is, I looked in there and it was that Susan Jane Donahoe. And I guess they were sitting in there and it appears they're selling whatever stuff that's in there. And you know, I said, hi, uh, do you recall me? Do you remember me at all? Do you she goes, you're such and such. And I go, no, no. I said, now you used to live on the house at 1007 7th Street right there in Camas. And your mom's name is Susan Donahoe, isn't that correct? And she goes, yeah, that is correct. And I said, and your name's Susan. I said, isn't that so? And she says, my name is Susan. And boy, I'll tell you, it took her a minute or so to remember me. I said, don't you remember me? I'm your roommate, John. I said, you know, and I reminded her of things that happened in that house that only me and her know. And I said, I will not lie to you about, you know, what was done in that house or what was done. You know, this woman, at one point she told me you're worth something to me. Two dozen eggs, she broke it, she swept the house out, she says it's a coin sweep, and I was under a curse. And she was talking witchcraft then, and she talked about a little bit of witchcraft now too when I talked to her. I don't consort with witchcraft, and she's just kind of mixed up, but I'll tell you what, what they did in that house was Nightmare on 7th Street, and I told you guys that I couldn't, I just couldn't talk about it. And now I've met Susan Donahoe, and she's right there. She's just a few uh, uh, walkers down from my mini storage. And I think she has one just a little bit smaller than mine, or it's the same size, one of the two, but it's right there in the same area. And she said something about this here mini storage has grown over the years. And I said, my Uncle Ted built this. My Uncle Ted's shop right over there. I was your uh, roommate, Susan, and I reminded her of the things. And she told me, she said, you know, I told her it's nice to see her and stuff like this. And I said, you know, I said, man, you're just going to be friends. I said, maybe I can help you. 
she told me she's a hundred dollars down and I told her you could start selling stuff out of my mini storage tomorrow and here's Susan Donahoe and she's right there that's Susan Jane Donahoe that's the chick right there and this is a goddamn exclusive she came here and I'll tell you what she was a friend of mine and I goddamn tell you I told her this was biblical and she just pulled up you know I'm just gonna have to cut this off and geez you know it's kind of nice seeing her pull up and just as I'm talking I could leave the camera going because this is almost unbelievable to be honest with you but you know what I better not I think I got a some kind of a wasp or a hornet right here in the window too by the way right up in here and Oh, it's behind that glass. Okay, I got but I got buzzard under glass. Hornet under glass. It's a little horny for me, I tell. I've got my two chatterbait girls right here. Oh boy, they are fantastic. Little girl today has a girlfriend in the room, and I like what I'm seeing. I like what I'm feeling. I'm liking this whole Bonnie Jackson thing, and I've been down there, I went swimming, I go down there and I oar for a while, and if you see a little drip come off my pole thing, it's there. The Bonnie Jackson car, me and Sharia's here, Susan Donahoe's here, Jesus. And I'll tell you what, she told me, oh, there's the girl right there. I better get off this, and I'll talk to you later. Thank you, bye-bye.